Hey, 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 Brew Nuts. Today we've got a very special episode. Somehow, some way, we've convinced our significant others to join us on the show, Dibs and his fiance included, to taste a local beer for us. Uh, this beer is the Gerst Amber Ale by Yazoo Brewing Company. Be on the lookout for any differences or similarities amongst the couples. But first, a little history on this beer. The Gerst Brewery was the first official brewery in Nashville, Tennessee. Unfortunately, Prohibition shut them down and they never recovered. Yazoo has partnered with the Gerst House Restaurant to bring back this beer, and they've tried to keep it as close to the original recipe as possible. They describe it as a clean beer with mostly German malts and a hint of flaked maize. It measures in at 5.1% ABV and 11 IBUs. It's going to pair really well with your earthy cheeses like Camembert and Fontina, as well as smoked and gamey meats. Alright, let's check this beer out. Let's see what he looks like. Well, this is very amber, hence the amber L. No, it's hard not to immediately say amber. See mm -hmm. through. Yeah, it's you can, clear, see, you can clear. see through it. So uh -huh. that means that it's filtered, right? It's kind of like a medium, medium dark um, apple juice. I think it's a really pretty color. Like, yeah. I would, I like saying it. It looks it like a looks jewel. Like, it's like fall. It, it's a lot like your sweater. You don't usually want to smell him. But let's let's see what he smells like. Let's see. Weird beer. Funky beer. Yeah, it's got to smell some apples. Like a cider a little bit. Yeah, it's like a bright. It smells like beer. A it smells like beer. But I can kind of get the Oktoberfest, that German oh. flavor out of it. Well, here's the thing. Gerst is a German word, right? Definitely. It's got to be. It smells fruity to me, but I don't I don't know if they put fruit in amber ales. We... Okay, so it smells German and applish. It looks amber. Applish, I like that. It does smell good. It smells appetizing. Should we give him a taste? Let's give it a taste. Cheers, boys. Didn't really taste like anything. Hmm. Malty, lots of malt. Um, Watery. Sweet, sweet and smooth. Sweet and smooth, kind of fruity up front. Mm -hmm. I swear very, I taste apples. Very watery. Yeah, watery, but like in the back end, I feel like I taste apples. The aftertaste is really, really light. The aftertaste is kind of like dirty dish rag a little bit. Yeah, it goes down easy. I mean, it's I pretty like this one. It's, right? Yeah. It's pretty light body. It's like, not bad, yeah. Have you tasted dirty dish rag? It tastes <laughs> how a dirty dish rag smells. Yeah, how it smells. How like musty. Smells. Yeah, it's but, musty. Yeah. It's a good fall beer. Right, you take banquet and just put something in there. <laughs> they just laced it with a little bit of Flavor. apples. <laughs> Wait, did you just say that you kind of like this beer? I do kind of like this beer. This is going to sound awful and kind of mean, but cheap. Almost like a Miller Lite. Maybe a little nicer. Yeah. Not hoppy, not. It's, no, just, it's not much flavors. of anything. It's yeah. just. Mm -hmm. We did it. We did it. <laughs> Show's over. You kind of like a beer. You know, That's it. We should just quit this. How now. crafty is this? It's like, Yazoo. Yeah. It's, it's the crazy. oldest brewery in Nashville. Yeah, it's not bad. It's pretty easy. Yeah. It's pretty easy. Oh, gosh, I feel like we kind of need a group hug. Woody likes a beer. Job, oh. We did it, guys. Good job. I don't know. Do you like slosh it around in your mouth? Mm-hmm. Oh, y'all do that? <laughs> you should crackle it. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't taste good when All you right. do that. Don't do that at home. I'll, I'll tell you this, it's not very hop forward. Very true. It's not really we hop can, backward right, either. We can call right. it, it's not hop backward. We can no. call it malt forward. Malt forward. I can watch some football, drink this beer. Refreshing. Yeah. Can I say we should just chug it and get it over with? I definitely want to talk about the label. Okay. I like the bottle. The bottle is like very that. pretty. Classic. That is classic. So cute. I mean, this label says American heritage mm. with German influence. It said World War II, what? Dibs, what do you think? I enjoy it. I'm gonna give it 275 stars out of 300. Four, a solid four. And you yeah. only need 120 for Mario. You've already met Yoshi at the top of the castle. Yeah. I wouldn't buy this beer and drink a six pack. What do, what do you think, my friend? You know? I wouldn't buy it at all. It's not terrible, but yeah, it's like I'm not gonna. I could actually drink that whole bottle. I wow. Think. If I poured it out and released some of the carbonation in it, then uh, it it's the carbonation nation. that really gets you in the beer. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what that's what it is. I'd say a two. 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 Oh, two. 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 Grace two is like hates this beer. Don't like. That's what that means. You know, it's not, not my thing. Uh, eight out of banquet for me. I'm gonna give it a four and a half. Four. Yeah, it's a solid four. I'm gonna give it a 6.5, and I think that that means that you rated the beer. I think I did it correctly then. Higher than I rated the beer. <laughs> That's true. It's like kind of getting worse and worse with every taste, though. Well, we both go this way, so once we intersect, 
<laughs> and like a B minus in algebra, but somewhere we yeah, met, yeah. Yeah. and that's Gerst is in the middle. The bullion. I mean, I kind of feel bad right now. I feel like I hurt its feelings. Yeah, plus I think or minus B over 2A divided by the square root of 4AC minus. I was hoping for something that was just gonna like it put fireworks in my mouth. And, and that's the. I just think that you're probably paying. I mean, here's my like financial outlook on this. If you're going to buy a six pack, you know, you can buy a cheap Coors Light for, you know, what, six dollars? Is that how much that is? Something like that. And then this is probably $8.99. I would just buy the cheap beer. Mm -hmm. well, it's not that good. It's getting worse and worse with every taste. <laughs>